All right, weigh-in Wednesday. Let's see what the damage is. All right, 437. I can't remember if that's a loss or a gain. I'm going to have to look it up. Okay, so that is a loss. Uh, first of all, it is a loss. It is a loss of 2.6 pounds. I'll take it. I'll take 2.6 loss. It's not a big number. It's not the amazing numbers that I would like to see, uh, because like last week there was like that six or seven pound loss or something like that. But this week, uh, just 2.6, and I'm okay with that because it is a loss. It's not a zero and it's not a gain. Uh, and I know it's not all about the scale and it's about how you feel and right now I feel pretty good I'm I'm happy to be doing this and making the videos and talking to you guys because uh, Community helps with everything uh, being able to talk to you about the stuff that's going on in my life being on able to you know show you what I'm eating and doing that type of stuff is fun for me I enjoy doing that and going forward I would like to do more of that of course, I am. I am gonna do more of that. I'm. I'm sticking around this time. Um, so, yeah. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the content and engage. Let's let's have a chat about stuff. I mean, my last week, I feel like that went pretty well. I ate more uh, last week than the week prior, which is probably why it slowed down. Like I was saying, um, but overall. I mean, I'm, I feel good. I, I feel like I've been eating mostly right. There's probably some carbs slipping in with like the taco seasonings and the, um, you know, the, the other accoutrement, uh, as it were, because, you know, you, once you start adding like the taco sauces and the other miscellaneous, like, yeah, it's all low carb, but it all adds up. So, um, you know, it, it adds up. And then, um, yeah, of course, there is also stress that comes with everything, because I'm, I'm stressed. <laughs> i unbelievably stressed <laughs> right now, because I'm going through this move, and there's a whole lot of personal life stuff going on um, that I'm, I'm not going to really delve into, but a lot, lot of change all happening at once, uh, basically. Again... Yeah, unlike the divorce video that happened, you know, a couple years ago, this is similar but different. <laughs> There's a whole lot of a lot of changes going on in my life right now. So I'm moving into a two-bedroom apartment uh, next week. Uh, I'm gonna build the second bedroom into my own studio. I'm excited about that. I'm excited to be able to have like a space to be able to record things and do that kind of stuff with you guys because I I enjoy this. It, I don't enjoy much. I like I'm on antidepressants at this point. Like I don't enjoy much, but I enjoy making videos and talking and doing that kind of stuff. Uh, so bear bear with me. <laughs> it's oh, uh, it's a lot of change. It's a lot of stuff and it's a lot of stress. But I'm hoping that once I get into this new apartment and life. Uh, it doesn't necessarily slow down because it's never going to slow. I mean, we got aliens confirmed today. I, phew, Jesus. That's a whole tangent and not related to the content, but go look it up. <laughs> um, but there's, there's a lot of stress, a lot of stress. And I feel like, you know, we're, we're all in that wheelhouse of just everything is weird and stressful. And I, I'm just riding the wave at this point and I'm trying to lose weight and I'm doing a pretty darn good job of it so far. <laughs> Uh, and I'm, I'm happy. Ish. I mean, I'm sad. I'm depressed as fuck. But that's a whole different, that's a whole different thing. But as far as the weight loss goes, I'm, I'm good. So, yeah. That's, uh, that's the update for you as far as that goes. Um, I did stop at Kroger, uh, today. And I had to pick up some, like, toilet bowl cleaner and stuff. Uh, but I found a couple things that I wanted to, like, show because, you know, food product reviews, blah, blah, blah. I, I haven't done those in a while. So, um, I got these, uh, Simple Truth Keto, um, mini cookies. I, that's backwards on the screen, but maybe it'll be the right way when, when we get there. Um, I, Kroger brand. Who knew? I, I, I've been out of the fold for a little while, so I, like, all this new keto stuff is, like, 
wild to me. <laughs> like the fact that I can buy cookies at a Kroger and they're just they're keto cookies, like nuts, crazy. Um, but I, I've never tried them before, so I'm gonna try them right now and uh, tell you if they're worth it. If I can get the thing open. Okay, so they come in like a, a biggie bag like this. Easy to open, nice. Okay, there. those are mini. <laughs> those are mini cookies. They were not lying. Um, yeah, th those are tiny, 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 tiny. Uh, but, they're pretty good. Hmm, I'm almost in them. Almond flour is the first thing, so that's good. Uh, peanut butter, sugar-free chocolate chips, dietary fiber, cocoa butter, let's see, soy lectin, stevia, sweetener, vanilla extract, sugar alcohol blend, maltitol and sorbitol. So those are ones that, if, if I remember correctly, not the best, but they are pretty low on the list and everything that comes before it is mostly pretty okay ingredients too, surprisingly. I think these are like five bucks. I would say if you're if you got a sweet tooth, not bad, not bad. Uh, they also had a regular chocolate chip. Uh, I'm not gonna open those and try them right now because I just I just tried these, so that that is what it is. Um, I also, whoops, uh, got these Lily's gummy bears. Um, they <laughs> they um, have 42 carbs, but 25 of it is fiber. Um, and then a bunch more of it, uh, 14 grams of it is allulose. Um, if I'm remembering correctly, again, when I got into the, the end of my run doing the whole keto thing, um, allulose was just kind of starting to make its way in. Uh, I'm not sure if it's really good for you or not. I don't think anybody really knows. Uh, but it is a sugar alcohol that still doesn't show up in the sugar alcohol section, so they have to add like a little thing at the bottom to explain why this is low carb um so three net carbs for the whole bag um so i i know the deal with sugar-free gummy bears i whew, uh, i i remember <laughs> i remember but hopefully these do not make me explode on the inside um They're more chewy than I thought they would be. Hmm. Okay, so the taste is good. Uh, the consistency is okay. Uh, it tastes, it, it, it's got the consistency of a gummy bear, but like one that has kind of sat for a while. <laughs> um, little on the hard and chewy side until you like get through it and then yeah, it's, it's a gummy bear. Uh, so, I will finish those at some point, probably not today, um, and maybe not until after I'm done moving, because I don't, I don't want to deal with all the stomach problems going into this whole move and stuff, because I still got to pack everything. Well, not everything. I, I got to pack a bunch of stuff still. Kitchen, all that. Helmets back there. I, I got to find a place for those to go. All that stuff. So, if, if there comes a time when I finish these off and I have gastrointestinal issues, uh, I'll, I'll let you know because, um, yeah, I, I don't like that part of the regular, like, Haribo sugar-free gummy bears or any of the other ones that I've tried. So, uh, yeah, I'll let you know. Uh, but that, that's really all I got for this week. I mean, I'm doing pretty good. Uh, you'll see, uh, if you go back to the last video, if you haven't watched that, there's the food diary that I did for the previous week. I'm working on the new one right now. And I'm also starting to work on a video that has the whole like ADHD and its relation to obesity thing because there's a shocking amount of correlation there <laughs> so uh, I want to do a video about that and hopefully I'll get that out probably after the move but you know if I have time maybe I'll do it this week who knows who knows anyway um have you tried uh the the Kroger stuff 
um, the cookies or the lilies, gummy bears, let me know what your experience with those was uh, in, in the box down below. And I will see you in the next video. Okay. Bye-bye. I remember doing that. It was like the Markiplier thing back in the day, but bye.